Okay, so welcome to Math Storia and let's have this problem. Mr. Ocampo is considering to pay his outstanding balance after 3 years of payment and the original amount of the loan is 100,000 pesos payable annually in 5 years. If the interest rate is 10% per annum and the regular payment is 26,379.75 pesos annually, how much is the outstanding balance after the third payment? So to solve for this problem, we're going to use this formula. But first, we need to list all the given. So for R, that's the regular payment. Since the regular payment is 26,379.75 pesos. And for the rate, that's 10%. So R, that's 10%. Then in decimal, that's 0 0.1. Then for the time, since payable annually in 5 years, so the time is equal to 5. Then for M, since the regular payment is annually and the interest rate is per annum, so therefore, M is equal to 1. So to solve for the interest rate per period, that's J. So that's R over M. So since R is 0 0.1 and M is 1, so therefore, J is equal to 0. 0.1 and for the number of periods that's n so we have m times the time since m is 1 and the time is 5 so therefore the number of periods is equal to 5 then for p since uh, after the third payment so therefore p is equal to 3 so to solve now for n minus p, so n minus p, since n is equal to 5, minus p is equal to 3, so n minus p is equal to 2. So to solve now for this problem, so using this formula, we just need to substitute now all the values. So we have this, the balance after the third payment equals the uh, regular payment that's r so we have 26,379.75 times 1 minus so we have 1 plus the interest per period that's 0 0.1 then to the power negative n minus p and n minus p is equal to 2 so to the power negative 2 then over j so j is 0 0.1 so to solve now for the outstanding balance after the third payment so we have this 1 minus since we can combine these two numbers, that's 1.1. So 1.1 then to the power negative 2. Equals, then divide. So divide by this 0 0.1. So 0 0.1 equals, then times. So times this regular payment, 26,379. 0.75 equal so this is now the outstanding balance after the third uh, payment that's 45,783.04 so we have this 45,783.04 pesos so this is now the outstanding balance after the third payment